Dude, that is a lot of blue. When a new player might read off the Scottish Resistance's massive list of stats, it might be easy for them to think that this thing is a straight upgrade to the stock launcher. Five out of six stat modifiers on this are positive, with only one being negative. It features a faster firing speed for your stickies, more ammo, more stickies out, and the big one detonates only sticky bombs that are under your feet or near the crosshair. These are all well and good, but I hardly ever see this thing used in casual or competitive and it's due to its massive glaring downside, a mere second added to the sticky's arm time. First off, let's look at what this thing is good at. It's made for sticky traps. You can trap multiple doorways or areas and detonate only a specific set at a time, meaning that you don't have to lay out all those stickies each time you want to kill someone walking through your trap. So this launcher is ideal for multiple traps at once, making it perfect when you're defending a point and the enemy has only a few points of entrance, like in maps such as Dust Bowl or Junction. Though I hope for your sake you never have to actually play an injunction. But when you're using the resistance in this more defensive way, it's a lot of fun and it's surprisingly effective. In that case, it outclasses the other two launchers. So, are you underusing this? No, 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 not at all. The problem is that the resistance fails when used offensively at all. The near second arm time means that if you shoot your stickies directly at someone, the enemy is going to be 10 feet away by the time they're armed, and you'll be dead. Don't use these offensively. Which brings me to why this weapon is bad and why no one uses it. Devil Man's whole thing, besides alcoholism, is that he is versatile. He can play both defensive and offensive role, and can switch between the two at a moment's notice. The resistance takes away that versatility. It is ultimately better at a defensive role, but that's at the cost of a massive amount of offensive potential. Yeah, you have pipes, but you only have four of them in a clip, and those are a bit more unreliable. The grenade launcher is a great weapon with massive damage potential, but any Devil Man main will tell you that Sticky Bomb Launcher is his bread and rum. At the end of the day, you're getting a slight improvement in defensive ability in exchange for a massive downgrade in offensive ability. So how can we fix this not very good weapon? Well, I'm not actually sure myself, but one thing I'd like to see is an increase in reload time. With a faster firing speed and increased maximum ammo, it can be difficult to utilize all 14 stickies you have available to you due to the reload speed and being able to get them all into position faster would make this weapon's role more defined, effective, and more fun to use. So are you sleeping on the Scottish Resistance a little bit? Maybe? It's still a really fun tool for casual mode and if you're like me and you enjoy catching people wandering cluelessly through your traps. Just hope you can aim your pipes.